I heard they're doing this, I don't know, oxygen, high altitude simulation. I really have no idea what it is. So I'm gonna do it, but first let's find out more about it. <laughs> so basically what we're gonna do, what's your name? Marisa. Marisa, yeah. we're gonna get Marisa on the bike and basically going to monitor her blood oxygen levels and start you off with a really high concentration of oxygen. So in the large part of the reservoir, it's about 95, 90% pure oxygen in there. So we're gonna start you off just breathing that. There's gonna be more oxygen than you've ever had. Wow. In your life. And then what we're gonna do, once you're warmed up a little bit and we've got your oxygen levels up and you're really saturated, we're actually gonna switch you to breathing low level oxygen. It's about 14, 15%. So it's about the equivalent of being at 10,000 feet. Wow. Like you said about the altitude. Train. Not like so outer space. Not outer space, just 10,000 al feet altitude. Okay. Mountain. <laughs> um, and what that's going to do is it's going to start dropping your levels of oxygen down. The idea behind that is that what we're trying to do is, is challenge your system into a bit of an emergency state when things start opening up. Yeah. Your body starts use, utilizing resources differently. And so basically everything's going to open up. So you're, you're going to vasodilate, which means all your capillaries and stuff are going to open, be hungry for oxygen. And then when you're in that state, we flip you back to the super high oxygen. So we're, you're sprinting at this point, everything's moving really fast, and then we flush in the high oxygen again. Well, I would assume that like we're getting adaptive hormones kicking in, yeah. body gets in fight or flight mode. Yeah, a little and bit. then once you provide that relief, yeah. It's sort of like um, cold shock thermogenesis or something, right? A little bit, like, yeah. It's, it's more about getting getting the oxygen deeper into your tissues. Oh, that's why you bring it back at the yes. end. Cool. Yeah. And, and why you do the adaptive piece. You know, you could sit in a hyperbaric chamber for days to get a similar effect because it takes so long for the oxygen to get deeper into your system. Whereas here, because we're exercising and because we're opening and challenging the system more, it's, it's a lot faster. Okay. okay. I'm excited. So it's going to be a bit like an interval training session. Okay. So, is that We cool? won't record the whole thing. 